ICMB V6 Error Messages Type This type of messages are used by Layer 3 devices to notify the sender why a packet could not be delivered. In this lesson, we are going to explain only four types of error messages. Number one, destination unreachable, ICMB v6 type 1. An ICMB v6 destination unreachable message is sent when a packet cannot be delivered to its destination for reasons other than congestion. Number two, packet too big, ICMB v6 type 2. IBV6 allows only the source of the packet to perform fragmentation. When an IBV6 router receives a packet larger than the maximum transmission unit, MTU, the router drops the packet and sends an ICMB V6 packet too big message back to the source. The packet to big message includes the MTU size of the link in bytes to allow the source changing the size of the packet and retransmit it. IBV6 requires that every link in the internet having the maximum uh, MTU of uh, 1250 bytes compared to 68 bytes for IBV4. Number 3. Time exceeded. ICMB V6 Type 3. Before a router forwards an IBV6 packet, it decrements the hub limit fields by 1. If the hub limit field results in a zero the packet is dropped and i uh, and an icmb v6 time exceed exceeded message is sent to the source the last type of error messages is parameter problem icmb v6 type 4 an icmb v6 parameter problem error message is generated when a device processing a packet finds a problem with the fields in the main ibv6 header or an extension header and has to discard the packet so any problem in the parameter, this type of message will be generated. Okay, the next type or the second type of uh, ICMB V6 is informational messages. This type of ICMB V6 messages are employed to provide information required for diagnostic tools such as ping. They are used to help devices discover and share information with each other. Ping utility uses echo request message ICMB v6 type 128 and echo reply message ICMB v6 type 2029 so ping utility uses two messages echo request and echo reply it is common uh, these messages are commonly used to test uh, network layer connectivity between two devices a device sends an echo request to prompt the destination to return an echo reply to verify network layer connectivity 
to layer 3 connectivity. There are three types of ICMB v6 information informational messages used by multi listener discovery. Number one, multicast listener query. The router periodically uses this query to learn which multicast address still have listeners, listeners on the router's directly attached network. Okay. Number two, multicast listener report. This message is sent by the listener to register for a multicast group. The listener sends this, uh, sends this message in response to a query or sends it without waiting for a query from the router. The uh, third uh, type of uh, informational messages that are used by the ICMB uh, v6 is multicast listener done. When a listener wants to stop receiving a traffic uh, for a particular multicast group, it sends a multicast uh, message to inform uh, the router uh, that it is leaving the multicast group. So, just to stop receiving traffic for a particular multicast group by a listener or by a router. So, the informational messages uh, could be said that uh, uh, are used by paying utility and uh, multicast listener discovery technology in addition to ping utility and MLD the ND protocol uses some info ICMB v6 informational messages there are five ICMB v6 informational messages that are used by ND protocol. Number one, router solicitation message, RS, ICMB v6 type 133. One Number two, router, uh, router advertisement, RA message, ICMB v6 type 134. Uh, Number three, NIBAR solicitation, NS message, ICMB V6 type 135. Number 4, Niper Advertisement NA message, uh, ICMB V6 type 136. And uh, number 5, Redirect message, ICMB V6 type 137.